next morning. I reckon we had to head out uh, to school early this time. I have to introduce you to your teachers and all the starters. I'll go ahead along with you this time, but tomorrow, oh, you'll be making a trip by yourself. Let's hit the road. On a hill where a large tree stands. Uh, disclaimer, I am not a good voice actor. And... Quality is going to be shit. I know I'm also starting like a midway through the game, but... I don't... The intro is boring, okay? And that about summed it up, Mr. Principal, Mr. Vice Principal. So I will be leaving the kid in your hands. So go on, show your manners, say hello. Ho ho ho! It looks like we've got another addition, well, another fun addition to our class. What a delight! I'll be glad to take responsibility for the education of the young charge. Good, I'd be recognized as seeing myself out. <laughs> I don't think so. Hmm. Just don't cause any trouble in school. We ain't got enough troublemakers on our hands. I can't weather another scandal. No, no. This vice principal watch. Hog. <laughs> Wouldn't I would say that's quite unnecessary. Do we truly have any troublemakers at our fine school? I'm slowly devolving into a high double door. <laughs> of course we do. One in particular. A very the very bane of my existence. My prediction? Watch Alex gonna devolve into Snape somehow. And Sim of course already devolving into Dumbledore, so... <laughs> uh. You know exactly who I'm talking about. Mr. Principal, and I... And don't you deny it. My dear Vice Principal, I'm sure you never mean to speak ill of our precious students. Good morning. <coughs> Good morning, Mr. Farfetch. Ah, yes, good morning. Morning, Mr. Farfetch. Ah, and a good morning to you, Miss Dealer. Morning, Teach. Hey, Teach, why are you always carrying a leak around with you, huh? Well, it would be quite far-fetched for me to not carry around such a useful tool. And I'm afraid you're wrong about one thing, though. This is no leak. It is a stuff. It's a stuff. Uh, but never mind you that. Come along, everyone. Here your seats. It seems as though uh, the students have begun to arrive. Let's introduce you to your new classmates, shall we? I am lightheaded for playing football, so yeah. Everyone, I have a special treat for you. We'll have a new friend joining us today. You'll all be learning together from now on. That's the kid who... You're the one from... God, that was not even... <coughs> You're the one from yesterday. God, that is terrible. What's that? Oh, God. What's that? It appears some of you are already acquainted with our new friend. For those who are not, I'd like you to meet Donut. Donut has just moved here and lives with Mr. Nesley, who you may know. I hope you all get well. Long well. I'm gonna be late. I don't have. I didn't have time to think of a voice for you, so this is it, I guess. God. Typical. So oh, the troublemaker strikes again. The voices are just melding into one. Oh, sorry, sorry. You okay? 
Wow, you're the one I. It's that crazy kid from yesterday. Everything's. Everything's going back. I can't hold up. Okay. Uh, I'm gonna say Phil for our voice acting has been shit. Huh? Where, where am I? Part 2. <laughs> oh, you've come back to us. This is the school's nurse's office. You blacked out and lost consciousness. It was Bulbasaur who took you out. Do you remember anything? Well, it's good you're awake now. Looks like you, s you should be fine. Oh, me? I'm Oratino. I'm actually the village doctor, but I also help out teaching health here at the school. I'm sure you'll see me around. I'm afraid you're... I'm afraid class started without you. If you're feeling up to it, you should probably hurry and... Hurry be back and join them. It's hard to voice and read. I have a hard time just reading by it. No. So, the voice second too. So, in the end, the Grovar Graveler, fed up with the lack of sleep, decided to try counting Marie. Hey. One Marie, two Marie, three Marie, four Marie, five Marie, six Marie. Oh, look! There's Donna! Oh, God. Ow, eh? I'm listening. Uh, Donna, you're finally awake. Are you okay? What is it? What is voice? It's totally my fault for running into you like that. Excuse me! We are in the middle of class, you know. No one said you could leave your seat. So sorry, Mr. Farfetch. Every, every female, I can already predict every female character is going to have the same voice. Close to the same voice. Donut, are you well enough to rejoin the class? In that case, please find your seat. There's an open spot next to Bulbasaur. <laughs> Oi, all eyes up front. Oh, God. Ah, uh, my head. Yes, sir. Now then, let me continue with the reading. Let's see. Where were we? Ah, oh, yes, right about here. Seven, Marie. Eight, Marie. Nine, Marie. Ten, Marie. When Reed. And recess finally rolled around. I began when yesterday. Wait, well, you don't know? You really saved Gumi out there. <sighs> Wait a minute. Just what did you do, Donna? So everyone was loving you around here. Can't speak, can't talk, can't read, can't do shit. Heh. <laughs> the. What a bunch of dummies. Why, why, you just like, like, hire Bulbasaur. <laughs> hey, Bantam. I got an idea. What kind of idea? They're same voice as one's day's life. Well, you see... Uh, yeah. Wind bell. I love that the bells would. And finally, class drew to an end for the day. And after school... <laughs> I'm using my aerator voice in this, and it's just so not epic. It's so not what you can do. Goodbye, Mr. Farfetched. I uh, see you tomorrow.
See you tomorrow, Mr. Farfat. I'm just speaking in the back of my throat. <laughs> yes, yes. You take care on your way home. Hmm. Hey, Dark. Hey, no, no. Oh, God damn it. You just smoked your gun up. Trouble. Okay, I'm good. Hey, no, no. Let's walk home together. I'm gonna fucking hate this voice. Alright. I'm sorry I never got to finish sharing around the plaza yesterday. I'm afraid I got something, you know, something popped up and got in the way. <laughs> but today, today is a new day. Well, I take you around after this. God! Oh, why? No! I'm going to change the I'm changing the voice, okay? I can't survive doing that for... This just... Can't do that for the guy that speaks the most in this game. Uh... Yeah, I guess, I guess that's kind of right. But today, today's a new day. How about I take your own after this? Okay. I already looked around myself, you bitch. What? You already looked, turned yourself around? Oh. That's that, I guess. Oh, I know. In that case, how about this? I'll show you someplace really good to show you. Someplace really good? Yeah! It's the best, and you'll feel great after visiting it. You'll see! Don't you want to check it out right away? You want to check out... You want to see this really good place? <laughs> I would say no. For the next dialogue, but I want this guy to shut up. Because my voice hurts. <laughs> it still hurts. Really? You really come with me? Yes, please try to Alright, you're the best. Then follow me. This way, hey! We... That is slow. Oh, is this way again? Hold it right there. Hey, I told you to stop, didn't I? <laughs> Wait, this is a... What is it? We got some place to be, see? What? Oh, you're turning into a mobster! <laughs> We weren't talking to you. It's Donna that needs to hear us out. So, Donna, we're gonna go with the smoker for three wheels back in. No, that's gonna hurt because you speak quite a bit too. Uh, uh, this. So, Donna, you did a pretty good job making it out of the forbidden forest yesterday. What? <laughs> What? Don't have to... You went into the forbidden forest? <laughs> I have no clue what Bulbasaur's voice should be, and I don't know. And I'm just gonna be struggling with it until I find something I like that isn't someone else's voice. No one's talking to you, you little... Uh, no. Bye-bye. Animals. Get out. Don't you think making it out of a boring place makes you tough? Yeah, don't go thinking that. There are way scarier places than that in the world. Yeah! There are? Where? Right, I forgot your, your, your explorer said you want to be or whatever. Not even a point. If you clear or even scare your dungeon, we'll make you guys go. So how about it? You up for the challenge? Oh, I, need, oh, I should have grabbed water. Yeah, I'll go, I'll go. Never done it at you! <laughs> <laughs> oh god. Would you like to save? Yeah. We're gonna take a break. Okay. I'm gonna get a drink. My throat hurt real bad, you see?